Hey, what's up, everybody? Spabrock here, and today we are going to talk about the hot fix for the recent patch. We actually had two, but one of them, uh, you know, it's kind of outdated right now. But so I'm just gonna go into the, what we got today, right? Uh, I'm gonna start off the game, and uh, in the meantime, I'm just gonna read it to you. It's pretty short, but the, it's pretty useful, especially if you uh, if you were upset with some of the gun mechanics. Um, there was a lot of problems before. Um, but yeah, let's just get into it. All right, uh, it's a pretty short list, and then uh, I haven't actually touched it yet, so I'm kind of excited. I'm, you're literally getting my first uh, first reaction to it. So we're in a respawn right now. But yeah, so updated weapon tuning begins. Okay, for the rifles. So now they're touching the guns like we were complaining about, because if, like I said, it was one of the worst things I've ever seen gun wise. So it's good that they're doing it. So yeah, rifles up first. They said they w we will be using relevant feedback on the changes to the rifles as baseline to begin work on other weapon classes. Please let us know your thoughts in a meaningful and constructive manner. So don't be a baby. Give them some, uh, you know, some proper feedback. Please also keep in mind that the goal for the weapon tune is to maintain the SOCOM feel the team has worked so hard to create. All right, so rifles now reward tap and in short burst fire with quicker recovery of crosshair stability. Okay, so I guess you could tap it. I'm gonna I'm gonna see right now. Overall, I have improved accuracy due to lower spread slash recoil rates. Okay, um, nice. That sounds good. Our our better balance for control use with recoil changes. That's nice. That's perfect. Um, real as in real life settings vary to reflect stability of rifle type. Uh, type. Okay. Reflect ammo type better for damage given on various body areas. Oh, and one shot headshot kills remain okay so one shot headshot still here so calm Not, get you nice and salty um, animation tuning leaning uh, lean stationary now is more aggressive and stand and crouch with rifle and pistol okay this allows players to stand closer to objects I hope that means the lean looks better um, tweaking of the jump while moving framework to improve appearance Additional work still planned for a height float once window solution is in place. Yeah, they're, they're waiting for the window, like a way to jump into windows a proper way. So, uh, yeah. Tweaks to some animation sequences to pre prevent player gun going guns down while still shooting. Team is still verifying if any other animation overlap even exists. And uh, there was another hotfix for it for the messaging. So, vote to kick. Only one person could see, I mean, only one team can see it before both teams could see it. And there's a bunch of bug fixes when it when it comes to being locked. Before, if you dive to prone and got up too quick, you get locked. If you were planning or defusing and, and you got at and tried canceling it, you get locked. Um, some stuff where if you went to first person, blah, blah, blah. UCR host consumes two ammo for every shot. Just a bunch of little stuff um, that's not there. So... If you had a problem getting locked into an animation, then uh, that was probably it. Alright, so let's go into the game. Alright, tapped up. Get the chat out the stream. I mean, out the way. Um, okay. So, um, let's see. So, the first we'll go into the animation. Alright, it said something about the jump. Yeah, that jump looks so kind of wonky. I don't know what they did to it, to be honest. They said to make it a little, a little bit better. I know they... Oh. Oh, okay. Did he kick like this before? Yeah, I think he did. What did I just do? Never mind. I think it's... Oh, okay. The neutral jump looks good. Um, I feel like i just seen something different. Am I bugging? Maybe when you jump sideways. He's kicking, right? I don't know. I feel like I saw an extra kick. It's I, I literally just got it like 15 minutes ago. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So, let's see the lean. All right, the lean was pretty whack before. Um, oh. Oh. That looks so much better. Hey, hold on. I just noticed something. Oh, okay. I was going to say. His gun uh, was up. So, um... That lean looks so much. It looks kind of like SOCOM a little bit. I know they used to put that whole the whole body into it. It looks a little bit better. Uh, no, actually, it looks a lot a bit better because before it looked pretty awful. It looked like he was just turning his head. But now you could obviously see he could, uh, he's actually pointing his gun out and stuff. I have that freaking PUBG in me where I lean here. 
Wow, you really can just peek and shoot. Wow, that's awesome. Wow. That's I'm actually dumbfounded. That's that's freaking sick. Um cool. And bef before yeah, you would get locked. Like when you would dive and stuff. Um but let's look at the let's look at the guns, alright? So the M41ST. Um obviously there's a scope and stuff. You know. Nice. But um that was there before. But let's check the Wow. I have a, I th oh my god, I'm gonna, if I can, I'm gonna clip a side-by-side, -side, a clip of, if I have an old video on, on hand, because that's incredible. Look at this M4 I want to see. Look how much it bounces. In the next video, you're gonna, uh, I mean, in the, in the comparison video, if I still have the clip, you're gonna see it, uh, this thing used to bounce like crazy. You know how important this is for controller players? Well, I'm gonna put my controller in right now. That is insane. Wow. Because now people on controller can actually aim. I mean, this might make it a little bit better for the keyboard players too, because they get a little bit more precision. But, uh, yeah. So. Oh, oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's a lot better. Shooting somebody over here. Hey, let me see if I spray. Oh yeah. Yeah, daddy. That's how you do it. Yep, the gun mechanics are getting better. Uh, not, uh, let me pick a different gun, but I just want to see the spread. Oh, that's crazy. That looks insane. That let's try a really high fire rate gun like the BP right now. That's good. Don't get me wrong. That's great. So um, I did a little bit of a like a feedback thing for the devs. Like, I, I gave them a little bit of, like, some feedback for the guns. Like, just comparing SOCOM. So, it looks like they listen. So, that's pretty cool. Um, so, the high fire rate gun. We got the nice... Ooh, that doesn't look good. Okay, that's, that's fair. The BP is, like, a high fire rate gun. And I can live with that. And that's, again, that's, that's deviation. You know? The guns are going to be different. So, I, I like that. that. That spread is a little tight for it, though. <laughs> Oh, but it, uh, obviously I'm gonna have to play with it more, you know. But that looks pretty good for now. If the and they said they they adjusted the damage values. Of, again, I can't really test that right now. But yeah, let me just uh, let me just pick another gun. You know, again, it's only the rifles. Um, let's see. I like the GR36. So or whatever the AR36. And, uh, what other guns are there? BR3 and M16. Oh, we could try the M16. But also you could you could tap fire again. So let me just you know spray. Yeah, that that that's fair. This feels like the RA14 okay, from SoCon. SoCon. Wow, that's that's fucking incredible. Um, again, I have to test some more. There, there's probably gonna be like really minor adjustments. But at this point, this is a point like where you could kind of like be like, yeah, I, we could we could fix the gun a little bit more. But the one thing, the cooldown rate from the recoil is awesome. Look look how fast uh, it comes down after max spread, right? That's pretty fast. Before it would be uh, probably like around the same rate, but the kick would be so high that like it would take longer. And um, all the guns had like the same recoil pattern, it seemed. And uh, it was pretty, pretty wet. Better rest up, boys. Tomorrow won't be any easier. How come I can't? Yep, there we go. Uh, AR. Let's pick the M16. No, 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 no. M16. There we go. All right. So anything with the, uh, all right, the M16. M16 feels the same, but it's it's really it's just it's still over like over over the. It's pretty accurate for the most part. I don't know what they touch for all the ARs, but spread wise, it looks it looks a lot better. I think the M41 is might be the best gun in the game right now. <laughs> so. uh... Let's see if I can do the BR3 real quick, and the loud M4, and then, uh, yeah, I'll give you a little bit of how I feel. Obviously, we're, uh, testing it, so, I think the guns are, they're in a better place right now. Again, we have to play with it and play test it, but yeah, this is the BR3. Hmm, the BR3 has good fire rate. 
fighter spread, I could already tell. I could already tell. Yep, and it kicks up. And then, uh, well, let's see how it is when you're shooting from afar. Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's, it's a little bit better. Oh no, that's a lot better actually, because I did a video and I act out. It's, it's definitely like around the same thing. But, um, yeah, it's, uh,. It does feel a little bit better. So there, there is deviation there, and I kind of, they kind of stay true to the guns. Hopefully, I could get the loud of four off. Yeah, it's, the loud of four is a lot more uh, has a little bit more recoil. It might add, it might need a little bit more work, but you see how quick it comes down the cooldown rate. Uh, see, that's what they meant when when you tap it and you burst fire. You see how quick the the um, What's it called? You see how quick the the recoil comes down? That's what you need to make controller players um, have fun with the game, in my opinion. I feel like whatever controller player um, benefits they get, keyboard and mouse is probably going to get <laughs> a little bit more just because, you know, you get more precision. But I feel like that's okay because we want this to go on PS4, right? And uh, I wish I could check the damage values. That'd be, that'd be awesome, but... I guess we're gonna have to wait but yeah guys uh, that's pretty much it for this video um remember I'm probably I'll try to do a side-by-side -side comparison right next to each other but no promises because I got to see if I have the clip if not I'll put like an annotation in the video by now you probably would have seen it um, but yeah uh, the, the good mechanics are better now we just got to test them out in game but yeah, guys, uh, I'll catch you next video. Remember, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash MrSpab, M-R-S-B-A-B. Follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Spab underscore ROG. I definitely want to stream now, um, now that the guns don't lock and stuff. So that's awesome. And uh, yeah, also um, follow the Reddit, reddit.com slash r slash H hour. Follow the channel. Support H hour. Support anything SOCOM, man. There's no reason not to, you know. Doesn't matter what the project is. Just do what you got to do. Alright, um, and I'll catch you next video. Peace.